Hello lovers of truth, wisdom and fellow warriors against consensus reality. Day four of freedom and um, it's feeling better and better. It um, gave, me, gave me the idea for this video actually and um, it made me realize how how much we allow ourselves to live a an unhappy we'll put up with it because we have to but we're not really happy about it kind of life um you don't really tell unless you're actually out of it and perhaps for the first time in your life truly following your authentic path you, pursuing the development of your authentic self. Um, I suppose I better clarify that at, the, at this stage um, for uh, you um, you new people who have joined. Um, see, when I first started this channel, I intended on um, doing all the wonderful sort of inner development, philosophical, esoteric sort of stuff. Um, whereas the, the other one, my now X main channel was, um, more focused on the sort of masculine, you know, MGTOW kind of stuff at the time, but, um, none of that really matters now. So, uh, as I continue the, to, to, um, laugh at the, um, continued bleeding of subs on my main channel, we can... <laughs> Have at it. <laughs> and, um, never, not once have I ever sort of begged for, for shares and likes and subscribed and all this shit. I've just, I cringe whenever I say uh, uh, any channel do that at the beginning. The way I say it is, if people resonate with what you have to say, they will flock to what you have to say. Simple as that. Um, it's like, okay, you know, you really want to do this as a career, so you're going to have to sort of follow the pre-programmed uh, jumping through hoops script. No, you fucking don't. They can go boil their heads. Do whatever the fuck you want. Do whatever you want with, to make yourself more authentic to yourself. And, um, yes, I've kind of noticed the, um, views dropped off a little bit because um since the last one certainly people thought oh let's see what's he, what he's going to say here well probably not what you expected <laughs> and um and probably it's the abrahamic gobshites put off by the uh, mule near um right in the middle of my um picture here <laughs> and all those wonderful things on the tr on on the um on the left listed which probably make them feel a wee bit uncomfortable and uh but as you can see clearly and as has been the um the theme for this channel since i first created it to speak the truth is a lonely path and um you'll know you're you're speaking the 100 percent unadulterated truth by how lonely it feels sometimes <laughs> <laughs> but uh, if you even have just a very small handful of um, real people to enjoy chatting with or uh, sharing the odd message with or um, bullshitting on um, in the live stream chat or even on the live stream itself yes citizen I'm talking to you <laughs> um, you know then it's all worth it um, Especially when you have um, two, or, two or three of the guys regularly sending them uh, a message here and there and sharing links or whatever, you guys will have no idea how much I appreciate that. So, yet absolute fucking legends. But um, it's uh, in this world of increasing falseness, artificiality, and pretense, um, you'll really perhaps have no idea how truly challenging it is to even try to be authentic let alone um 
entertain the idea in your mind. Because all of us, um, well, almost all of us, uh, I would say the 99.9999% of us have and do continue at some point to wear various masks which express parts of our personality, parts of who we are. Um, but which may only contain sometimes a very small part of that self, of that true self, um, out of a protection mechanism most most of the time, because let's be honest, most normies are um, are cunts. Most normies are gobshites, mean spirited, backstabbing gobshites, um, who would not know courage, truth, or honour if it punched them in the face, or if it ejaculated all over their face. Uh, let me be crude for a moment, shall I? Oh no, he's not using the pre-approved, um, let's pretend we're a guru, sort of like um, Eckhart Tolle, sort of tone of voice, and namaste, and pretend we're all fucking little, little punsy gurus now, right? For oh, fuck's sake. Whenever I used to um, come across these people in various things, I used to be involved in such things as... Um, drum circles and things like that um it, it would, would be surrounded by people like that and i would inwardly cringe um a part would a part of me would assume that um that painting by what's that what's the artist's name edvard munch you know that scream painting <laughs> inwardly <laughs> the inward the inner scream there we go how's that for a good um either two ways it it's it would make a good book title or a good um painting title <laughs> the inner scream um and you could tell they're being fake and whatever and especially when you come across dikey um uh irish women called guy i'm thinking yeah can you say cultural appropriation darling We'll have our, our mythology back. Thank you. Which is kind of funny when um, when certain when a certain someone who for whom I have a great deal of respect usually um, gets all sort of gets his, his knickers in and out because people mispronounce um, Tua de Dunan to uh, Tuatha de Dunan. I'm thinking, yeah, and yet you're talking about. Um, Hellenic Gnosticism in Alexandria and the development thereof, even though you have no fucking idea what you're talking about. Yeah, I'll just stop you there. Thanks. <laughs> I'll um, pretend, I'll stop pretending to know anything about um, Celtic history and pronunciation or those really strangely uh, spelt words if you s stop pretending you know anything about the ancient Hellenic world. Okay. And, um, <laughs> but um, we all pretend. We all wear that mask of illusion at some point or another. Every single one of us. Um, and we do it to function in this pretend, in this fake society we live in and which we created, and which we allowed to be created. Which is kind of sad, really. Um, you know authentic, real um, people when you meet them. They're the salt of the earth. Um, what you see is what you get kind of people. Usually they're country people too, by the way. You would find very, very few truly authentic city people. Because the environment is not conducive for authenticity. Which is why the last time I went to Sydney, even though I live one and a half hours by train, is um, to see Iron Maiden in concert about five years ago, four or five years ago, which was absolutely fucking epic, by the way. <laughs> That's the last time I set foot in Sydney, uh, and my sort of um, brother seems to thrive on that environment, which kind of says more about himself that I would care to go into right at this point in time. 
But um, when you when something dramatic happens in your life, like me being made redundant from my 17 year long job recently, um, it helps to give you that much needed kick in the pants to face your own. First of all, to face your own falseness and then to fully embrace and enjoy and even love your own authenticity. Despite people saying, oh, when you tell them you're going to take a, a year off, they say, oh, what are you going to do afterwards? Oh, and you'll spend all the money and you'll be broke. Yes, this is the way normies think. This kind of bullshit never even entered into my mind. And these are the people I fucking detest and I want nothing to do with anywhere near me. Which is why many of us tend to be a lone wolf by nature. Coupled with um, some choice um, hermetic tendencies. But uh, once you start to embrace your, your authentic self, your true synchronistic path, i.e. what you're truly supposed to be doing for yourself at this time, you'll know it, you'll feel it. You'll feel that flow of, um, of energy which the knowingness from this, this life choice, you just know it. It, it. No one can really truly uh, describe it. You will know it when you come across it. And embrace it when you do because it's going, it is one hell of a wonderfully um, interesting ride. So um, I think I'll leave it there. This um, this channel of mine, I will not deal with any of the old um, using the drama as um, teaching material because there's so much more effective teaching material out there. Um, and I want this channel to to be untainted by all those fucking gobshites. So I won't. Um, be well, be wise, be true to yourself first. Be authentic and be reverent. The um, mind travel, the sarcastic mind traveler on guitar, out.